The Star Forge was a colossal automated shipyard constructed by the Rakatan Infinite Empire in 30,000 BBY through the use of strange and eldritch dark side engineering. The mega structure was assembled in stable orbits above Arbo, the star of the Rakatan home system, using vast numbers of enslaved labourers taken from thousands of worlds. And upon completion, the forge represented the crowning achievement of the Rakatan Infinite Empire. Approximately 28 kilometres high and 11 kilometres kilometers across. The size of the Star Forge was extraordinary for its time, easily the largest artificial structure ever assembled in space, and the area between its colossal dorsal pylons was more than large enough to house hundreds of capital ships. The station was designed to process pure energy to replicate fleets of starships, and its linear and elegant design reflected this process perfectly. Using collectors at the tips of its ventral pylons, the station drew a vast stream of energy from the surface of the Rakatan Sun. This energy was artificially imbued with the dark side of the Force, using strange and ancient techniques, before being applied to replicate enormous quantities of durable metal and sophisticated components. These materials were then transferred to the station's dorsal pylons, where they were used to rapidly construct and deploy hundreds of thousands of combat spacecraft. Though the forge's external armaments were very limited, consisting of only a few turbo laser batteries around its launch bays, the station's internal defences were far more formidable, including an army of rapidly constructed battle droids, deadly energy fields, and hundreds of anti-personnel turrets to help repel borders. The station itself was a nexus of the dark side, and was considered to be at least partially sentient and self-aware, corrupting any individuals it encountered to feed its powerful foundries, and it was these traits that ultimately resulted in the downfall of the Forge's creators. The Rakata were by nature a cruel and malicious race, ruling their empire through intimidation and savage barbarity, and these inherent traits allowed the Star Forge to corrupt its creators with little difficulty, creating fear and paranoia, which led to numerous uprisings and civil wars, until eventually the Rakatan Infinite Empire had devolved into scattered tribes of savages, no longer possessing the ability to operate their own technology. In the Rakatan's absence, the Star Forge remained dormant, but thanks to its extensive self-repair systems and high level of automation, the station managed to remain fully functional through tens of thousands of years of abandonment. Though the creation of the Star Forge and the subsequent fall of the Infinite Empire was an incredibly important part of galactic history, the events leading to the Forge's final destruction are arguably even more significant. Across the course of the Jedi Civil War, the Star Forge had fallen into the hands of Revan and Malak's Sith Empire, and was put into use constructing a vast armada of Sith warships. This naturally made the location and destruction of the Forge into the top priority of both the Galactic Republic and the Jedi Order, and both goals came to fruition in the Battle of Rakata Prime. Fighting above the Rakatan Sun, a Republic battle group under the flag of Admiral Fawn Dodonna was able to defeat the Sith warships, protecting the massive station, and with the help of the redeemed Revan, the fleet successfully disabled the Star Forge's orbital stabilizers, causing the massive station to collapse into its own energy stream, where it was completely obliterated. Though the Forge's 26,000 year lifespan had finally come to a close, the station's legacy would go on for far longer, with surviving components of the Forge being used to create the infinite engine, and great battles being fought over the remains of smaller Rakatan stations, such as the Foundry, in the hopes of reclaiming even a small fraction of the Star Forge's unstoppable power. Thank you for watching Space Doc. Please remember to like, subscribe, and share for more science fiction spacecraft summaries. If you enjoy the channel, why not consider pledging your support on Patreon? For just $1 a month, you'll be able to access the Space Doc schedule to see what's coming up.